Better you remember them the way they were. Both of them? No, Jesus, no. Don't say that! Don't you say that! Mary! Mary! I want to see my hands! Please, please! Let me see my hands! I want to see my hands! We've prepared a brief statement. As representatives of the Stardust victims, we wish to make it clear that we have no problem with the legal probability of arson arrived at by Justice Keane. But we emphasize that no positive finding of arson was arrived at and no such evidence to date has materialized. We welcome his damning indictment of Mr. Eamon Butterley, in particular with regards to Mr. Butterley's Recklessly dangerous practice of keeping exit doors chained or locked. All he had to do was hire an extra three men to supervise the doors. Three? Wouldn't have cost him any more than 50 quid. That's roughly one pound for each life lost. One pound. On receipt of legal advice, we have forwarded a letter to the Director of Public Prosecutions, Mr. Eamon Barnes, calling for the owners of the Stardust to be prosecuted for manslaughter on the charge of reckless negligence leading to death. <laughs>